Very good morning, guys. Today I'm at the Conrad Los Angeles. Brand new hotel here, about six months old. Opened the summer of last year, 2022. I'm here at the ground entrance to the hotel. This is where your car will pull up when you arrive to the hotel. This is located in the Grand Complex, brand new area with uh, residences and a little shopping area. As you can see, there's separate parking. Um, but for now, let's focus on the Conrad. So, just a brief introduction. This is a uh, really nice hotel. Just let's just the see, you'll see for yourself. So I'm gonna approach the elevators here. Uh, there's some construction noise on. Yeah, here we go. And so the lobby is on the 10th floor. Look, look at that. So this elevator also goes up to the Grand Avenue level with the shops and dining. But we're gonna focus on the uh, hotel experience, like I said. So the door should open here. And then you're greeted with this really nice, very classic, modern luxury lobby. So yeah, it's really early in the morning here. The sun hasn't even come up yet. But, uh, so the elevators for the guest rooms, they're separate and to the right. But, uh, there's a few restaurants here. San Laurel, which is, I'll be having breakfast and I'll show you that. Not a buffet, just an a la carte restaurant. And then Agua Viva, which like the name sounds is the poolside restaurant. And then of course the pool. So let's just take a look at the lobby here first. You'll see here, the space is quite stunning. There's a lot of alfresco space, being this is LA. Then the Walt Disney Concert Hall, very iconic, right across the street there. Let's see if I can go outside. In the meantime, the San Laurel restaurant is right there to my right. And then this is the La Bar. Really awesome space. This is really comfortable seating all around. And then here's the outdoor area, which is accessible, awesome. So here's the outdoor area. Really chilly, but really nice day here in LA. There's the Walt Disney Concert Hall, iconic place. And then the rest of DTLA, wow. the distance. All right, let's go back in here. I'll be having breakfast later today, so I'll show you that. But that opens up at seven and it's only 6.40, I think, right now. Good night. Let's take a walk this way. Uh, and this is the reception. Looks like no one is here right now. But this is normally where you'd be checking in and checking out. The guest elevators are just that way. So, let's take a look at the lobby bar. Another really nice space. Gotta say, this is one of the most stunning hotels I've ever been to, at least in terms of design, uh, in in America. Good morning. And uh, yeah, lots of alfresco space here. Nice place. Everyone here is super friendly too. Really love it. All right, let's check out the pool, which is just that way next to the elevators. All right, I'm right next to the guest elevators. And you'll see here, this is the entrance to the pool complex uh, and the Agua Viva restaurant. So let's just go through here. You gotta go outside. And I th I'm pretty sure these are the residences. The building is a little bit taller than the building we're in, which is right here. See a nice view of that. But anyway, let's check out the pool. So, I mean, right now it's uh, January, so it's pretty cold, but I'd imagine this place over the summer is quite the vibe. 
especially here in LA. Always sunny and nice and warm. You can see the sun peeking out over there. At least I hope you can. And then here is the poolside bar. It is really nice. Like I said, the design here, beautiful. Looks like uh, for this Agua Fever restaurant, however you say it, uh, there's an open kitchen, so you can watch your meal being prepared if you're inclined to do so. And uh, yeah, I mean, look at this. So it looks like they have a nice setup for if it's a little chilly, like right now with the fireplaces. Very cold. All right, now let's go look for the pool. Which is right in front of me, I believe. Hopefully it's not locked since I don't believe it's technically open. But let's find out. Let's go use a key card that you have. And it is open. There you go. And here's the pool area at the Conrad LA. Stunning space. Just a nice classic pool. Very clean. Looks like they have some cabanas. And some, of course, some loungers with some nice side tables here. But yeah. Great space. All right, now I'm gonna head down one floor to the uh, spa and fitness center. And then after that, that's about it besides breakfast. So let's go. Okay, stepping out the elevator. It smells fantastic and I know why, because the Conrad Spa is right here. And it looks like uh, the fitness center is actually on the eighth floor. And unfortunately, I'm not gonna have a treatment here, but if everything is if the spa is uh held to the same standard as the rest of the hotel i'm sure it'll be fantastic but let's head down one more floor to the fitness center all right i'm at the eighth floor this seems like this is where the fitness center is uh, i'm not sure oh there we are fitness second we get key Oh, I see, okay. So you go upstairs and that's the uh, spa. But this is the fitness center. Very nice space. Just bumped into the door there. But if you'd like a spa, here's the menu in case you're curious. I'm sure prices are going to be pretty expensive seeing we're in LA. And then you got your amenities here. So you got some water, some uh, unappealing looking fruit, then disposable earbuds if you've forgotten them, and some towels. And uh, as far as the gym goes, it looks like it's already pretty crowded, but looks like the very nice high-end brand new equipment here. And it looks like they have everything you could possibly want including a uh, weight training area. So yeah. Actually fun. Okay, it's a pretty compact gym. But everything you need, weight training machines, pretty standard stuff. Everything is clean in there. Uh, can't film too much. Don't want to disturb people working out. But yeah, all right. That does it pretty much for the hotel amenities and facilities. So let's uh, head back up to the room. Uh, I'm gonna grab some stuff and then we'll head to breakfast as soon as it opens. All right, see you there. Okay, so here we are at the breakfast restaurant. As you can see, it's a pretty awesome space. Lots of natural lighting. And you can see here to my left, it's the Walt Disney Concert Hall. 
Um, if you get a table outside when the weather is nicer, you'll be able to see it. And here is a amuse-bouche that I started off with. Uh, comes complimentary, of course, if you're dining here. Um, forgetting what it was. And then here's my main entree. An omelette with some Spanish ham and these beautifully done potato wedges. I do want to comment on the service here. Um, a really warm people working in the restaurant. Very friendly and of course uh, just like the rest of the hotel. So yeah, really stunning space and uh, that's about it for this video guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. The next one will be the Orient Jakarta going back in time. Peace. Oh, 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 oh